Okay, now we want to study results view. So now this one right click, go to results view. Okay, it will not show any results. This one also you can change to results view. No problem. Now we study in 3D window. Why we don't see any reaction forces at moment? Because our load combination we put none. For low cases we put none. Okay, let's study with low cases first. And the low cases loading cases go to let's say dead low. Then dead low. First order linear. Okay, now these are reserved for 1D elements. 1D elements mean beam column will show. Okay, click to results. It will show under you click the result under 1D element it will showing it is showing axial forces of column. How about if this shade we want to slightly bigger just pull a bit bigger okay now this is axial force we cannot see the value how to see the value we come to text just click on forces this is axial force so click on forces reaction also you can click but we haven't checked for reaction yet okay and take it just forces showing 72.1 kilo newton this axial force this 72.1 is under the load how about impulse load 93.4 very little right because this is only under selected load we can do load combination click it then we have none change it to this load combination okay our columns 751 kilo newton 209 uh, uh, 714 kilo newton this under this load combination how about this load combination you can see it for various load combination this is column axial force okay now we want to see under 1d can see beam and column then we want to see okay under this load combination we want to see you can see any load combination we want to see shear major what is shear major shear major is beam shear force it will show you the beam shear forces diagram you see the shear forces moment major is beam bending moment okay beam and column bending moment shear major is column and beam shear forces how about shear minor very little beam Shear minor are ne very negligible. Shear by axial will show in both the right. Okay, we go to movement major is column and beam movement major. Movement minor column beam do not have very little. Movement by shear. Shear wall forces we will not see in this 1D result. Okay, axial force. Go back to axial force. Okay, now I don't want to see it. Click it. How about deflection? This 1D deflection, click the deflection we will see the 1d element beam column deflection deflection for extraction 
wild rising or sad rising, total deflation. Now we enter tax, we are we have clicked the forces, we must click deflation. So deflation will value will show 1.8 means this beam is deflated 1.8 millimeter for this low combination. How about other low combination? You will not show it. Okay, this only this low combined nation. Now you know how to see 1D elements, exit force, shear force, bending moment, and deflection based on diagram. Okay, now and click it. What is 2D element? Support reaction of 2D element is wall or foundation. Okay, 2D. 2D elements in shear major. It's a force. Okay, let's say it's a force. Forces. Reaction. Okay, yeah, you can see it. Moment. M Y M X M Z is four at the base. Why is that? M X Y Z total is only at the reaction area or base. Now you know how to see the results. Come to one D element, you can see it back. Deflection, you know how to see it. Now we antique it. Okay, this is and the first order linear you will not see any slap moment reaction you have to come to fe chase down for the slap reaction okay